Hello everybody, I hope all of you are doing well and I am making this video to highlight a very important but interesting difference between a salary and a stipend in PhD. Basically, when I was looking for a PhD, I did apply for a fellowship, but somehow I ended up signing a contract because my skill set was more relevant in that case. But when you join a PhD through a fellowship, you are considered as a student and you are offered a stipend. Whereas on the other hand, when you sign a contract, you are actually offered a salary. And depending upon how you have joined it, the visa process, if you're flying to another country in that case, might also be different, right? The second thing, the stipend doesn't increase after every year, but the salary does increase by a maybe by a small amount, but it does increase every year. Okay, and the amount of bonus that you get in both the cases is also very different. So when you are actually, you know, joining a PhD, the route through which you join it also does matter a lot. And depending upon which fellowship you have joined, your salary might be higher or lower. So you need to keep that in mind. And the other thing is that you do enjoy some benefits if you are a student, but you also might have to pay the tuition fee, depending upon the graduate school you are a part of. Whereas when you are an employee, you don't pay any tuition fee. And the other thing is that if you're having a fellowship for say three years or five years, what if you need some extra time to wrap up things? Will you go to your PI to ask a temporary contract or you will ask from the fellowship some extension? How are you going to figure that out? And how common is that the particular fellowship gives you the extension? These things you need to keep in mind when you are applying for a PhD. So I think, you know, when I was looking for a PhD, I did not know about these details. These are very minute details, but they do matter in the long term. So please keep that in mind when you're applying for a PhD and see you.